Sports. For the second year in a row, the UAH hockey program receiving a message about a stoppage of team activities. Last year, the team was one of many that was set to be cut due to COVID-19 and budget cuts at UAH. But luckily, it was saved due to a tremendous fundraising effort in a few short weeks. Now the Chargers hockey team is in the penalty box because they lack a home. As of Wednesday morning, UAH had not secured a conference home for the upcoming season. Two years ago, seven teams, including Bemidji State, Bowling Green, and Ferris State announced that they were leaving the WCHA, which of course put the future of that league in jeopardy. The CCHA did not accept UAH's proposals to join, and the AHA hasn't yet formally responded to their proposal. Now, there's an option of being an independent, but according to Dr. K. Smith, that plan doesn't work in the Chargers' favor. We initially talked a little bit about independent, but then pretty much came together as an administration. Um, decided that independent was not going to be what we were going to do. We do want to be a part of a conference, um, but th there are a lot of things that make that difficult. It's really hard to recruit when we're independent. If we're trying to build a good program, we've got to be able to recruit well. Uh, it makes scheduling difficult. Yes, you can get a schedule, uh, but to get enough home games to make that something that your fans are able to support makes that challenging. Really hard to play any type of postseason as an independent member. Uh, so there are a lot of things that make that a challenge for us.